In this week's AHA Money, we're gonna talk about moving forward in your business and in your life. Let's go. My name is OJ Gakar and I'm the CEO of Epiphany Consulting LLC as well as the founder of iDream Achieve Academy as well as a master strategist and I want to welcome you to another AHA Monday. It is AHA Monday for me. Thank you so much for the birthday wishes that came for me. My birthday passed this past week and now here we are on the precipice, big word, of August. We are almost into August, ready to roll, ready to go. Here we go. I'm so excited about what we got going on with our business and the things that we're creating and the things that we're getting moving and going in our businesses and our life. And I'm excited about what we're going to be able to create just for you. So I want to talk about AHA Monday and it is a four letter word and not the four letter words that have been flying around a little bit this week as we've seen going around as far as in, in, in news, but it is a four letter word I want you to talk to, I want you to think about today and focus on, and that is move. All right, we've got to move in our life. We've got to move forward in our life. If you are standing still in your life, then all you are doing is being, is just falling backwards. And so for us, it is about our movement, our forward movement in our relationships, our forward movement in our business, our forward movement in our personal lives, and what it is that we create for that. And so I'm so excited about today's message because it really hit me home as far as about making sure that we are moving forward in our life. So I got some affirmations for you today. The absolute first affirmation I have for you is in my plan, each task that I complete brings me out one step closer toward the achievement of my goals one step closer toward the achievement of our goals. So that means that in order for us to be moving forward, we have to have a plan that is actually bringing us steps closer into the achievement of our goals. So that means that first you have set your goal and now our plan is taking steps incrementally to be able to say, this is how we achieve our goals. So you can look back at the plan as we take the steps back forward because as Stephen Covey talked about, one of my favorite, the absolute favorite habit of success for me is to begin with the end in mind. So if this is the place that we're trying to get and we're taking these steps forward to it, then we should be able to look at in our plan and look incrementally how we're getting to those steps. And so understand the fact that that's really important in whatever goal it is that you're doing because if we're just doing stuff just for the purpose of doing it, what are we doing it for? So we want to make sure that we're actually taking steps toward those goals and making our, our way to be able to do it. So you want to make sure in your plan, each task that you complete brings you to that next step. So we're looking at how those things go together with that. Here's your second affirmation. Positive affirmations help keep me focused on my goals and banish thoughts of self-doubt. I have to understand that for me, I have been meditating more than I ever have in my life right now. That's because we're moving some things that we've never moved before. And we've gotten to some different places and some things in our business, but now we're starting to move to another level. We're starting to take some things to, to another place. And for me, it's been about meditating, meditating on the positive thoughts, not just saying, oh, these, these positive things and oh, oh, oh this, this whiz bangery this out as far as that, but it is, what is it specifically that we're working for? What is it specifically that we're working for? So you should be meditating specifically on the things that you want to accomplish in your life. Thinking on those positive thoughts, putting those things in places where you can see them, putting them on a sticky note. They still have sticky notes. Put them in your car. Put the sticky notes there in your car. Put those different pieces there and say, okay, here it is. And so for me, it is everywhere in my life. Everywhere in my life is limitless because that's our next event that we have that's coming and we're working toward and we're open car, opening car on limitless here, here very soon. And so that's been the thing that's been there for me and like, boom, here we go. Where am I going? Where are the things that I've done? I'll tell you, this past weekend, I got the opportunity to be at my family reunion um, in Nashville. And so 
that has been just a time for me to really re-energize myself, be around my family members, pull ideas. I love being around positive people. And when I get the opportunity to be around in my family and be able, be, be able to do that, that's something that does something for me. And so just having those places to refuel for yourself and have those positive thoughts, that is so unbelievably important, okay? It is so unbelievably important. And the third piece of this, is that we must set a time management schedule for how it is we're gonna do it. You can set your goals and say, here are my increments and here are the things we're gonna get done. But if you don't have a time that you're actually working on your goals, if you don't have a place to be able to put that, to go from here to there, then now we have an issue because now we've got just a dream. And so I'm not talking about just dreaming, I'm talking about achieving it. And so the way that we turn those dreams into achieving is by making sure that we achieve those goals, that we put goals into that. And so for me, it's all about the game plan, or the game plan. It is dream, believe, work, achieve, repeat. That work is so unbelievably important. But we have to have the time in there in order to be able to work to get those things done and to knock those things out. If you like what you are hearing in this AHA Monday, you are going to absolutely love our event that we have coming up called Limitless. The Limitless Summit is coming to Memphis. We are limiting at the limit of the summit, how many people can actually attend because we really want for people who actually are trying to make real changes in their life, real changes in their business, real changes that we're going to give real steps. It, this year for me, it is all about no fluff, just facts. No fluff, just facts. We're absolutely still team crushing it, but it is all about no fluff, just facts. What we're going to bring to you are the facts to be able to get to the next steps in your life. We're going to give you real actionable steps in order to be able to take yourself to the next place in your life. You want to hit this link that is here in this video and let's go to the limitless summit. Let's become limit, limitless in our love. Let's become limitless in our mindset. Let's become limitless in our business and the opportunities and the things that we're putting together. And how do we structure and put those things and knock those things out? That is what we are creating. That is the thing. It's going to be an amazing event. It is on October the 28th, Saturday, October 28th. Things will never be the same. Limitless. Join while you can. We already have a lot of people who are super interested in this, in this event, and we're going to open card. It's going to be an amazing event here in Memphis, Tennessee. You want to be here in the place in Memphis for it. All right. So I hope you had a wonderful, wonderful week. I know we're getting ready to move forward. We got a ton of things that we're getting done. My name is Ojinga Carr, and I dream, I achieve. Have a great week. Bye bye.